A 14-year-old Derby girl is battling for her life. Becca Crow was diagnosed with something rare, ovarian cancer, back in September. And rather than giving up hope, the eighth grader created a bucket list. Kicks Jordan Shefty joins us now. And Jordan, she's uh, had a number of her wishes already fulfilled, right? That's right, Mike. With the help of many, most of the items on her list have been checked off. But there is still one thing that Becca wants to accomplish. She'd never had anything more than a cold, very healthy, very active, and then just seemingly overnight, uh, everything changed. 14-year-old Becca Crow's life took a 180-degree turn in September. She was diagnosed with stage 4 ovarian carcinoma. For it to strike a teenager, it is extremely, extremely rare. Not only rare, but also aggressive. Becca immediately began chemotherapy, and initially the tumor responded. That gave us all such tremendous hope. We thought, wow, she's going to be the one who beats this. And um, we were not right. The tumor metastasized, and doctors determined there was nothing more they could do to stop the progression. She kind of created a bucket list. Among the items on her wish list included riding a horse. It was just something that she wanted one more time. Getting behind the wheel of a car. I have never seen a girl with a bigger and giggle. <laughs> and being a bridesmaid in her sister's wedding that was set for March. They arranged for the chapel at Wesley, so Becca got to walk down the aisle. While all of those wishes have come true, there is still one more she'd like to fight for, spreading awareness. This was such a shock to everyone, and she wants people to understand that this could happen to anyone. A simple gynecological exam could catch the cancer early and maybe give the next person a different outcome. It's going to be pretty hard to lose her at Christmas, but um, we want her to be happy. Again, doctors say there is nothing more they can do. She is under, there are medics at her home and they are controlling her pain and helping her out to make sure she's comfortable. Yes, I can imagine a gynecological exam for a, a, a girl that young is probably not a normal procedure, right. but if they had done that, they might have caught this. Maybe. There's no knowing, but th there's a chance, so it's hard. It's hard. Yeah. I mean, you don't think of a 14-year-old girl needing to go and do that. But right, because it's such a rare cancer. And the cancer is so aggressive that in a matter of weeks, it just takes over. So well, it's such a sad story. So but sad. At least it's nice that... She's getting this bucket list filled. Absolutely. A lot of nice people out there helping her. Absolutely. And one more thing. You saw in the story she held up a lot of peace signs. That's mm -hmm. her favorite thing. And she's asked people to send in videos and pictures. So I want to give one more peace sign to Becca. Okay. Wishing her the best. Good story. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you. All right.